Hello and welcome to the first class of our 15-3 challenge for the month of April. I'm so excited to be on the mat with you. It just takes 15 minutes. 15 minutes of moving your body three times a week to have you feeling more energized, more motivated, and just feeling more confident and healthier in your own skin, which is what it's all about. So today we have a 15 minute energy boost class. I can't wait to get started with you. So when you are ready, roll out your mat and let's begin. So we will start in a standing position. So bring your feet a little bit wider than your hips here. And let's start with some energizing breath. So we'll inhale. So we bring the arms all the way up over the head and then exhale, release. And again, inhale. Good, and exhale, let it go. Good, just two more here, inhale. Exhale, drop it down. Last one, inhale. Exhale, this time we're gonna place the hands on the mat and see if we can lengthen through those legs. Just hanging here in our forward fold, maybe taking some shakes and some nods through the head. Breathing here, lengthening through the breath. Good, and then from here, we're gonna inhale as we start to bend through the knees. And then exhale, pressing into the heels, See if you can lengthen through those legs. It does not matter if your hands aren't on the mat. If you're here, that's totally fine. Go wherever your body feels best. Inhale as we bend through the knees. Exhale as we lift it back. Good, we've got two more. Inhale and exhale, lift it up. Last one here, inhale. And then exhale, good, lengthen through those legs. Let's walk our hands over to the right hand side. Come onto your fingertips if you can. See if you can lengthen through your spine, fold down even further. Breathe here. Good, and then we'll walk our hands over to the left hand side, reaching over, clawing into those fingertips. Breathe here. Good, and then we'll bring the hands back into the center. Inhale, bend knees. Exhale as we start to roll all the way up through the spine to standing. Beautiful, let's take our right arm, reach it all the way over, coming into our side stretch. Breathe here. Good, and then let's windmill those arms coming all the way onto the other side. Beautifully done. Draw yourself all the way back up through center, and then let's come to the end of our mat. We're gonna take a deep inhale here as we sweep the arms all the way up. Exhale as we bring the chin down to the chest and we start to roll it down through the spine. Inhale as we bend through those knees. Exhale to walk the hands out carefully, not to rock the hips from side to side here. We're gonna take four mountain climbers, so bringing the knees into the chest. One, two, three, Four, beautifully done. Walking the hands all the way back here. Inhale, bend knees. Exhale as we draw ourselves all the way back up. Good, and again, inhale. Exhale, bring that chin into your chest, rolling all the way down. Good, inhale, bend knees. Exhale, walking out, scoop belly towards spine. We do our four mountain climbers. Beautifully done, walking the hands back to the feet. And then slowly rolling yourself all the way back up. Let's take two more. Inhale. Exhale, we roll down. Beautiful. Inhale, bend knees. Exhale, walking the hands out. Four mountain climbers. Good. Keep that core connection going. So keep your navel drawing back towards your spine. Beautifully done. Last one here. Exhale, chin comes to the chest, we roll all the way down, beautifully done, inhale, bend knees. Exhale, walk it out into your plank, four mountain climbers, good, and then lowering the knees down, finding your child's pose. Breathe here. Lengthen through your breath, filling the back body with the inhale, 
And then on your next exhale, we'll start to roll ourselves all the way back up to a seated position. From here, we're gonna slide our hands forward, tuck the toes behind you, come into a downward facing dog. Let's just take some pedals through the heels here. So lifting one heel and then the other. Really good. Breathing as we go. And then finding your stillness, grounding down through both heels, drawing that belly button back towards your spine, really engaging your pelvic floor, even in this position. Good, on your next inhale, we're gonna raise that right leg to the sky. Exhale, as we sweep it through, and you're gonna step that foot in between your two hands. We're gonna plant the left hand here, and then scoop up with the right. So coming into that beautiful twisted stretch. Waking up the body, giving it that beautiful energy boost. Good. And then from here, we're going to come windmill those arms into a warrior two position. So if you're not familiar with this warrior two position, we've got our right foot facing off to the side. Our left foot is facing forward and we're just lunging into that right leg. Really good. Now from here, we're going to actually turn this right foot back towards the front of the mat and we're going to bring our hands together. We're going to come into a side lunge, so bending through that right knee and then we're going to push off that right knee woo, to boost yourself all the way up. Here we go. So we bring it up. Good. We inhale, bend. Exhale, push yourself up. Inhale. Exhale. Good, keep that going. Really drawing that navel back towards your spine. Keep breathing. Good, then we're gonna add a twist on our next one. So we're gonna bring your knee into your chest and twist towards it, bring it down. Come back into that leg lift, bring it back down. Good, twisting through. So we're alternating between twisting and lifting. Really raising the heart right now. Good, we have got this. Feeling so strong, 15 minutes. It's all we need to set us up for an incredible day. Feeling so strong, so confident in our bodies. Really good. Beautifully done. Just two more. And lift. And twist. Last round. And lift. And twist. Beautifully done. Okay, let's step back to the back of our mat. Sweep the arms up as we inhale. We're gonna take that onto the other side. Exhale as we start to roll the chin to the chest. Whoo, rolling down. Walking your hands back out into that downward facing dog. Finding your stillness straight away this time. Just take a second here to catch your breath. Lengthen through, scoop belly to spine. And then on your next inhale, we're gonna raise that left leg all the way to the sky. Exhale, as we sweep it through, place it in between your two hands. Beautifully done. If you need to scoot that back foot back a little bit, feel free. Plant the right hand, and then twist up with the left. Really good. Enjoy that stretch. Good, and then from here, we'll windmill those arms, so right arm comes all the way over, coming into that warrior two. I'm just gonna turn myself around here so that you can actually see me. So coming into that warrior two, just breathing here. Good, and then when you're ready, we're gonna turn this left foot to face the front so that we're in this side lunge, joining the hands together. We inhale as we come down, we exhale, Press yourself back up. Good, inhale, lower. Exhale, press. Ooh, losing my balance. <laughs> inhale, exhale, press it up. Beautifully done, keep that going. Just a few more here. And then we're gonna add that twist, coming into that combo. So as you come down here, make sure that your knee is coming over your toe. We don't want our knees coming outwards or coming in, that's gonna badly affect your knee, so really make sure that you're keeping your form and your technique here. If you need to go a little bit slower, that's absolutely fine. Okay, let's add that twist. So we're twisting towards that left leg. Good. And lift. Down 
and then twist. Woo! Really good. Now this is energizing. I feel so good right now. I feel like I'm on a little trampoline. <laughs> really good. Inhale, lower. Exhale, twist. Woo! And lift. Keep it going. And then twist. We've got this. Just two more. Lower. And twist. Last one. In. Bring it up. Inhale. And twist. From here, I want us to come into our squat. So bring your hips all the way back. Sweep your hands up by your ears. Weight is back into the heels. We're going to lift one heel. And then the other. Breathe. Lift one. And the other. Good. We've got eight more. And seven, six, good, five, fight for it, three, four, three, lock count, two, and one, beautiful, sweep those arms all the way up, Ooh, and exhale, bring your chin down to your chest as we roll all the way down, find your forward fold here, catch your breath, just breathe. Good, and then on your next inhale, we're gonna lower those knees all the way down, cross your legs behind you to prepare for our core work. So let's shuffle ourselves to the front of the mat here so we've just got a little bit of room behind us. Okay, we're gonna finish today's 15 minute energy boost with just a little bit of core work here. So I want you to bring your hands behind the back of your head Press the lower back into the mat underneath you and draw your navel back to your spine. Okay, we're gonna inhale here, prepare. Exhale as we curl up through the head, neck and shoulders. Bring your hands forward, bring them back. Good, so we reach it forward, exhale. Inhale, draw them back to the neck. Good, exhale, reach it forward. Draw navel back towards your spine. Exhale and reach. Inhale, bring it back. Good, exhale. Inhale, bring it back. Good, option here, you can reach the legs into that tabletop position. As we reach, can we lift that little bit higher? Inhale, bring it back. Exhale, squeeze and reach. Inhale, bring it back, keep that going. And back, good. And back, option here to lower the legs. So as we reach back to the neck, we can tap the feet. Exhale, squeeze. Inhale, bring it back. Exhale, reach, bring it back, good. Just three more here, and back, and two, and back. Last one, beautifully done, lower everything down. Just windshield wipe those legs from side to side. Whew. I don't know about you, but 15 minutes is all I'm doing today. <laughs> this is the whole point of this challenge, 15 minutes of movement so doable and it makes you feel so good. Okay, we're gonna finish off strong with some bicycle crunches. So I want you to bring your legs into a 90 degree tabletop position, making sure that your knees are coming on top of your hips here. Then from here, we're gonna lengthen through that right leg, bring your right elbow towards your left knee. Good, and then we switch, exhale, and switch, good. So you can take this as slow or as quick as you like, but we're really working into it here. We've got 10 more, and nine, good, and eight, seven, breathe, six, and five, good, four, and three, two, and one, beautifully done. Hug those knees in towards your chest, Woo, my core is on fire. Let's bring the hands onto your knees. Take some knee circles running in one direction. And then we'll reverse, come back the other way. Beautifully done. Hold yourself now behind your legs and we're gonna roll ourselves backwards and forwards all the way up to a seated position and coming around into a cross-legged seat. I want you to place both hands on your knees and we're gonna finish our 15 minute class today with some energizing breaths. 
So feel free to close your eyes if that feels better for you. We're gonna inhale as we draw the shoulders right up by the ears. And then exhale, we're just gonna let them drop. Release all of that tension. Good, and again, inhale. Exhale, let it go. Beautiful, last one here, inhale. Exhale, drop. Beautiful, and then we'll finish today's class as always by sweeping our arms all the way over the head on the inhale. And then exhale, draw the palms into the heart. Thank you so much for joining me for 15 minutes of movement today. I hope you really enjoyed it and I'll see you again in the next one.